man. <laughs> Ardmore is mad. You heard something? Got on her channel. You know, Jake took out another RDA train? Ardmore must be turning up the heat. Hope you can handle it. <clears throat> Check it out. It's the... You see where... We monitor air quality levels across the western frontier. Here, and at our field labs. It's gotten so much better since you took out that drill site. We've been researching the effects, trying to combat them. Pushing the RDA back where we can. Yeah. They're gonna kill this place otherwise. Just like home. Earth? Alma taught us about it. Did she give you the whole story? It's... Well, it's lost. Dying. Because we didn't fight for it when we had the chance. So now we're fighting for yours. We are going to make a difference here, together. Hey. Oh, Solek okay? was hoping to catch you too. Promised him I wouldn't forget. Tell him I didn't forget. <gasps> I totally forgot to do that thing. What is going on at that camp? Is the radio dead? At least... You did well out there. Did the humans teach you their weapons, too? No. I saw the RDA butcher my clan. Their bullets slicing them to shreds. That was my lesson. I know how it feels to be among the last of your people. The humans. They are like their guns. Brought here to cause pain. The humans here were RDA once. And I would not make it easy for them to forget. They are our allies now, yes. But this is not their war. They fight for the ghost of their homeworld, but we fight for our home. Mercer got what he wanted in the end. He made us into soldiers. You are not what they made you. You are not we. You will learn what that means in time. Starting with this. I made it for you. My own song cord? Like my mother's. All Na'vi wear one. It is your life's journey for the world to see, for you to remember. Hers had more beads on it. Each bead is a moment of great importance to the wearer. I have put one in place for now, to commemorate your first steps to freedom. Build on it. Build your own memories, each one a new song in your heart. I hope we can. Ritnella really wants to try, to know what it means to be Sarendu. But at the Tarsu, Nor seemed confused. Upset. Ewa shows us who we are, and who we can be. But she also reminds us of what has been lost. For your people, that is a heavy burden. I'm pooped. The back exit is not so exposed. He may be there. Good to see you. You're a good Perhaps shot, huh? Come easy to them. Hey, maybe we got can some new stuff sometime. ready. Come to gear up. Needs you take care of yourself. Pretty cool to see more Navi around. You guys are tall.
Noel, where are you? Maybe it's linked to... Nor must have come through here. Okay, think. Nor left HQ. Definitely came this way. Burst the vein pod. Must have brushed past it. The scent! Ah, oh, yes! Track the scent! You hearing me? I was tracking Nord by the cliffs outside, but I lost the scent. Looks like he crossed a river. I'm sure he's not gone far. Maybe he just wanted to explore a bit. Maybe. I'm going to keep climbing. Hey, Solek, you there? I think Nor's nearby. Maybe you could speak to him about your clan, how it feels. Solek? Alma and I are checking in on one of our other camps. It's gone quiet. You sound worried. The sky people continue to spread. You think they found it? Solek?
What must our ancestors think of us? Do you think they pity us? Sad to see what we've become? We're still Sarendu. Telan barely speaks our tongue. But then, he always preferred human words. Alma says we all need time to adjust. Alma is not Natvi. Why did the RDA come back? They wanted more of Pandora. They always do. Then we'll need to fight. Yes. Ahari would have wanted us to fight. Nella and Telan. We'll make sure HQ is safe. Way, Priya. Oh, that smoke! It's going to draw more on the to that camp! I'll get to them first, I promise.
on. Come on. Alma, stop. Find this place. It's not on any of their patrol routes. They're looking for us now. Uh, okay. You'll be fine. All right? Listen to me. You'll be fine. Yeah. Have you seen one of these before? Uh, no. Don't worry. It's easy. We'll have more on us soon. I need to stabilize him. Don't take too long. There's an oil refinery ahead. I'll make sure the idea come running to it. Keep them off Alman Hajir till then. You can handle this. I'll be quick.
What? Where? Breathe. Use your surroundings. Look for openings. The humans will stumble into your traps. Supplies. I'll be right there. Hurry.
They had plenty of amp suits. More than I've seen around here before. One of Mercer's favorite toys. Mm -hmm. You're always quick. I'm sorry you had to face them alone. I wasn't alone. Solek distracted them. And did you see that Nappy? Mm -hmm. Ikran are fierce. And very protective of their riders. Mm -hmm. An RDA scorpion is no match for them. Nappy. Dreamwalker and human. Fighting the Sky People alone. You are very brave. That was amazing. The way you took out that thing. Thank you. Wait. You have the map. You are Saar and Tu. The storytellers. Bringers of peace. My father said your clan disappeared years ago. We thought you were dead. The Saar and Tu spirit is not so easy to kill. I had hoped to find the resistance here, but... Saar and Tu. I am Etua, Sahe of the Aranahe. I knew your mother. I'm sorry. Our home suffers too. The sky people grow bolder and the land falters under their feet. And yet, my people, our home tree, we are not warriors, but war has come. My father still needs convincing, but he knew the Sarentu. He will listen to you. He must. I need to get them back. The others. They should know what happened here. Of course. I'll help with your wounded. My home tree isn't far from here. Tell them I sent you. But not all see as I do, so please don't mention my part in this. May your spirit soar with the currents of the wind. So, like, another Na'vi showed up to help. A Tua from the Aranahe clan. She asked me to visit her home tree. Maybe more Na'vi will join us now? Not likely. I tried before. They did not go so well. Their leader, Kanan, practically threw me out. He is not easily swayed. He's not afraid of the RDA? Rather, they have already caused him great sorrow. He will protect his people from further suffering. That I can understand. The Arane are normally united in all things, but the war has sparked some friction. Many will close their eyes to an uneasy truth, but a Sarentu may help them see.
may be reckless, but she has been. Do you think those two will ever see eye to eye? Perhaps they see each other a little too well. Could be. Lorraine is a strange reflection of her mother. Thank <laughs> you. 
Asahe should know better. Look, a real sovereignty. Home tree must gain her strength back. Before. What clan are you? They look odd. Etua invited me here to see her father. What's that on your face? It is the mark of the Sarandu. And yet the Sarandu we once knew did not defy Ewa with scraps from the sky people. It's all I know. They stole us when we were children. They have stolen many things. You were gone a long time. And you are young. Has your spirit been molded by the Sky People? Or do you remember the ways of your clan? Shoo! Put that away! <gasps> Sharp eyes. A Sarentu's gaze. But yours is heavy. Let Home Tree be a refuge from your burdens. We will put some color in your cheeks. Or in your clothes at the very least. You will pick up the threads of your people here. Oh. How I miss their stories. They loved our silk harvest. The sweet smell of dye my own too. Got not. Let me take the Saren too. The poor child knows nothing of our ways. Go. We will speak more when you are settled. I really must speak more with Etua's father, about the Resistance. Later, my Yagdu. Here's our Uluk Ektan, our clan's leader. Let us clean you up a bit first. You would frighten the hide off an Angsik looking like that. <laughs> Besides, I would not mention those Sky People if I were you. They are nothing but trouble, and Katna does not like trouble. Let me show you off a bit instead. The sky people our land. Will you allow me that? It has been an age since we had Sarentu around here. Your people certainly made life more interesting. One time, they told us a tale about the rare mating rituals of the giant Zakru. Apparently, it can take days. <laughs> But there will be time for that later. Our great tree has many stories, lived many lives, hosted your ancestors as our guest before you. And there was not one Saren to who could resist how our dyes oh, dance. Help, <laughs> he makes things worse. Come, see my weavers. Koranu, my dear, let us see your latest gorgeous silk. Is it not? Not as sturdy as it once was. Not since the Kinglor flowers closed. But still, you will not find better. Stronger than Zakru will, I promise you that. And you know how the Zezwa love to brag. Koranu is quite the weaver. She will help you out. Anything you need. Yes, please take my mind off this. I've been working on it for hours and... It's still not quite where I want it. You see, now is the time for beauty, for art. Speaking of which... <laughs> I am not sure of this fiber. Can I help with something?
Let me know if I can help with anything else. Relun! Finally decided to grace me with your presence, have you? And with a Sarentu, no less. Exciting, is it not? Another lost soul for you to guide over the rocky ravines of life. Better men to wait, Sarentu. <laughs> ah, still cross, I see. If you are smart, you will not let this one fill your head with silk and dye. The heart of the Aranae is taste. Relun is a prickly one, but he is the very best cook. He knows it too, Grant. And here, my dear friend, Kitangi. Nafika, taking the Sauron to under your wing already? A necessity, I should think. Look at these clothes. Pitiful. <laughs> Rough and prickly like a hermit bud. You lack the grace of your ancestors. They knew how to dress. Rough and prickly is what I'm used to. Well, now you will shine brightly. Rival the rainforest with our collars, my own too. Our silk will serve you well. Strengthened with storm beast hide, it will stop you from getting chewed up out there. Or at least, you will be hard to swallow. <laughs> Storm beast? Can this child track? I've done okay so far. Okay? What do we think of okay? Do you thrive on okay, child? Or do you only survive? Ito is on a hunt. I'm sure he will make a fine guide. <laughs> Indeed, if you can find him. There is a hunting camp near the water. E2 will be there, but do not upset his hunt. He will not thank you for that. Go on, my own two. A respectful hunt will show Katnat. You remember the ways of the people. There is no need to rush yourself, child. Go now if you want. Come to better yourself. Take good care of your bow. A little Zakru cheese would go well with this. Sotlek, I made it to the Aranahe. You weren't wrong about them. <laughs> But one of them took me in, Nafika. She thinks I can impress Katnat if I show him I can hunt properly. They sent you on a hunt? I should have showed you how myself. It's okay. Nafika said one of their hunters might show me how. Itu. <sighs> Be careful. You do not need to prove yourself to them. You are Sarendu, and Katnat should honor that. Come back to HQ anytime you like, all right? You are not alone, and there is much to do here. Etua deserves support too. The sky people are no real threat. They are tiny.
you seen it a was a time of great I'm worried sorrow. about her. Ewa wept so much. Who knew the Sarinto would trouble me? You cannot me. hold so many kinlor in the nest. You there. Come. Qu Sky people. Just along the river. They are like any unwelcome guest. They go where they wish, leave a huge mess, and move on. This time, however, it was just one of them, alone on a small island with a large fallen tree. That is strange, yes? Have we allowed them to become braver? A lone human? Are they still where you saw them? Oh, this human learned quickly. They were chased off. They ran away screaming, and I had a hearty chuckle at that. Nevertheless, I worry what enticed a human to that place. No time for chats with strangers. I cannot face Katla today. He carries such disdain. Time for action, yet all they do is talk. <laughs> Their paths have changed, and they are fighting with I other paths. So but things so rarely turn out to be so many people who are driving them from her. their home. Many branches, many roots, but one tree. An old Arana his saying that still rings true. I am sure you think God not stodgy in his traditions, but some things should not be forgotten. Care for others is to care for yourself. You miss this part of life, I know. But Tewa connects us all. The Great Mother is in all things. That connection must be nurtured. Share with the clan. Care for their wants, their needs. They will notice and share with you in return. You will see no more loneliness, child. This is what it means to be home. Can you save me from something? Now head of these berries, right? Did you gather more fresh nectar for Stranger. the king room? Plenty. Fragrant and sweet. The little lovelies will have a feast. Maybe I should take a break. Can you save me from something of Alemun and Neyan, our lookouts. Both of them are sharp and capable. A shame they can never see eye to eye. This most recent disagreement, however, it sounds serious. Neyan especially sounds so tense now. They could benefit from some Sarintu diplomacy, surely. The sky people rot Such our lands. They must be stopped. In the darkest sky. 
Katnat's anger grows. The king is ordered two men. You are courting trouble. There is no honor in fleeing this fight. Do you have no other clothes? Is E2 still out? Could be E2. Your Ikran is beautiful. My zombie. For her, no wind is too strong, no challenge too great. We hunt with heart, in harmony. Are you here to admire us? I would not fault you for that. No, I... I I'm looking for Itu. My name has reached other clans. Even lost ones. Let me guess, Nafika sent you to me. <laughs> She wants me to teach. Boring, I say. To be safe at home tree, telling the little ones of Hans, of adventure. They would not understand. What does danger mean to those who have only known safety? Zome and I tear through the skies together, our hearts pounding, our senses on fire. That rush makes us strong, fearless, the best hunters. Nefika did say you were hunting Sturm Beast. Can I join? Is that what you are after? Are you a good hunter? I was never taught how. Never taught how? 
What have your people been doing all these years? Did you find a land without hunting? A place where creatures lay down to die willingly? See there? Young hunters practice on targets first. Practice, or it will be the stern beast hunting you. You chose your weakest weapon. Are you trying to make your life difficult? Come. Not bad. At least your thanks will have meaning. My thanks? Are you serious? What have your people been doing? What kind of life have you lived? It's a long story. If I wanted to hear a long story, I would be at home. Each time you hunt, you must take a life. And so you must thank your sister or brother for their gifts as they return to the Great Mother. I see you. Your spirit goes to Ewa and your body stays to become part of the people. Thank you for these gifts. This way you let her ascend to the ancestors. Remember that, and do not waste the gifts you receive. The gifts? Right. The hide, the meat. You know what to do with them? Ah, oh, Nefika will show you. Go on. You do not need me to hold your hand. Ah! Oh. you. Your spirit goes to Ewa, and your body stays to become part of the people. Thank you for these gifts. Yes, here. I have some meat from my hunt. Nefika said you... You sent this forlorn miscreant to bother me? 
Everything is a joke. As usual. She said you're the best cook. <laughs> ah! The child knows how to charm. And honesty from you, Afika. I suppose that is typical of her tactics. She thinks flattery will get her everywhere. Come, come. Leave the grump for later. Now we turn to more serious arts. Is there something wrong with your home tree? Etua said it suffers. Ah, uh, the king again? Are uneasy. How did they ruin this again? We have provided for them since their flowers closed, but their numbers are too many. Gatnat would prefer Etua to focus all her energies on them. But I think that child does her best. Now pay attention. Gatnat should see you still have some Navi skill. And I should like to see it myself. Good. Good. That is progress. This is a simple recipe. I come at the to make it. Granddad would like this. Did you hear what Etua said? little Zaku. Who cheese would go well with?
Can those puny sky people wreak this much havoc? I do not believe... If it did, I hope I have something you like. Let me know if I can help with anything else. We do not need outsiders meddling. This leather drinks the dye. It is almost faded already. Yes, my friend, we did it. He was an old one and a worthy prey. Yes, I was lucky. Perhaps he deserved to live more than I. Our bounty is for all to share. Will you take some of the meat?
fallen log. Should be where Nawalk saw that lone human. I wonder if... Doesn't look right. Someone from the Resistance was here, not RDA. Good. Maybe it's linked to... Whoever was here... They kicked the tree. Brought down the hive. Not smart. But what else? Someone ran. Fast. So fast they dropped their tablet. Let's see. A resistance human flew here to work on something and kicked the tree. Frustrated, maybe? Tablet could have more. might know who owns this tablet. Remaining RDA Turns out the log I brought Pajin had something living in it. Something creepy and crawly with lots and lots of legs. I heard the flute player again yesterday. You think they know we can hear them? I like to imagine they come to play them. What's with that dude, Nor? Keeps scoffing at me every Whatever time comes I try to crack that joke. I will make sure we're ready I'm just trying to break the ice. You were right about Talon. Hey! What do you got for me? A tablet I found, dropped by one of our people. Do you think you can fix it? Ouch! Wish I could say yes. But what this tablet needs is a prayer, not a scientist. You said it belongs to someone in the Resistance? Yeah. Human, based on the boot prints I found nearby. And female, judging from the audio recording I snagged from it. They made a point to record in privacy. Away from HQ. A human female. Well, that narrows it down. <laughs> Good luck. I should check out those empty outposts. Great material.
Anka, have you been out in the rainforest recently? Well, yeah. I'm a pilot. I go out all the time. Gotta keep an eye on those RDA patrols, you know? Any chance you dropped a piece of gear or tech the last time you went out? What? No way. The only way I could do that is if I'm literally dropping a tablet from the cockpit or something. I'm not sure how to make it up to everyone. If I even can. I'm still feeling that flight. Anka's usually pretty smooth on the controls, though. Did you end up in some evasive action out there? Yep, my contents have shifted. Okay, fine. It was a stupid bet to make. Mm-hmm. I reckon I've seen Danny pick off targets at... What if they happens. decide to just land Bring one of those ISVs? Too. Hey, Priya. Have you been out in the rainforest recently? I wish. I have way too much work here. So, no chance you might have dropped something out there? <laughs> Only way that'd happen is if I knocked something off my desk and it slid all the way out through the entrance to HQ. Have you been out in the rainforest recently, Nalin? Yes, actually. I was at a field lab earlier. Just got back to HQ. Did you drop anything on the way back? Gear or tech, perhaps? Oh, no. I travel very light. The field lab has everything I need. Fewer things on me means fewer chances to be forgetful. So, no time to record poetry, I guess. Time for poetry? Ajir, how are you feeling? Oh, good. Better. Embarrassed. Alma says I was on Ikran. Me, on Ikran, flying with a Na'vi. And I missed it. The whole thing. Well, that was hardly your fault. I'll never get a chance like that again in my entire life. And I was unconscious. Not to sound ungrateful, I always wanted to see an Ikran up close. It's why I joined the RDA. Wildlife research. So-called research. I'm not sure I want to know. Of course. Close to home. Actual home, I, uh, I understand. Suffice to say, I did what I could for those poor research animals. In the end. So, I found this tablet out in the rainforest. You sure you didn't drop this? Definitely not me. Sounds like that tablet has more of a social life than I do. Whatever comes next. I think what we could do with one of them 3D printers. I mean, I'm not saying no to having some, but how... Why did you say tablet when I mentioned missing gear? I didn't say tablet. Just the first thing that popped in my head. I don't know. Were you thinking of this tablet? Where in the hell did you get that? An Arana had gatherer pointed me to where you dropped it. What... What did you find on it? I recovered some audio. Was that you? Shit. We do not talk about this here. Follow me.
It's embarrassing. I went to that spot specifically so no one would have to be subjected to my nonsense. How much did you hear, anyway? All of it? I won't tell anyone. Oh, all of it. That's great. I know the wasps didn't take too kindly to my poem. Ugh, why did I go to that spot in the first place? Real rookie business. What was I thinking? I guess you were thinking about love. I'm not exactly the best when it comes to talking about these feelings or whatever. Just really wanted a place away from all the noise to digest all this. You know the saying, love makes dumbass people do dumbass things, right? A good nothing that all did. Even without the RDA and these fun, tense times we live in, do you know how hard it is to try to be romantic here? I can't pick flowers without half of them trying to kill me. Maybe I can help. No, look, I appreciate the gesture and all, but let's not. I tried to get all mushy and ended up kicking the hornet's nest. Or a literal wasp's nest. Hive. Same thing. So forget it. I'll move on. I'm good at this sort of thing. Now the RDA knows we're a real force to be reckoned with. So this Ardmore, serious business, huh? Best believe. The RDA they don't make still someone around, force but at least that drill is table dust. manners. Be glad we only got Harding. There's nothing only about... Did you add more decorations to your hair? As many as I can. Remember how Mercer hated them? He told me they were dirty. I didn't understand then. Dirty how? I cleaned them again and again each time he pulled them from my hair. But you kept putting them back in. My mother wore them like this once. This honors her. A Sarentu home needs Sarentu traditions. I'm not sure I know what home feels like yet. Neither do I. I can barely believe we slept for so many years. But Thelan is happy. Nor is trying to be. And are you... happy? I want to find more of our ancestors with Ewa. Someone must know the truth. Why they would leave us, if they did. All the things that Mercer said, we deserve to know. Alma thinks Mercer is planning something, and more RDA arrive every day. I will do what I can to help her find out why. His failure will make me happy. I hope the clans will... I'm so relieved you're here. Everything's too awful. Like, so bad. You're alive, at least. Things look rough here. You can say that again. I'm trying to fix things up, but it's hard to focus. It just doesn't feel real. I know. I'm still finding out who we lost. Of course. I'm sorry. I didn't even ask. Anka's taken it hard. Lots of old memories, I suppose. I'm not sure what to say to her, how to be around all of this, you know? I don't know either. But I know Anka likes your hugs. Thanks. Maybe I'll give that a go. I should probably learn how to shoot. Hey, you see anything good out there? Let me know. I could do with a better rifle. Mine's fallen apart. Supplies seem low around here. Things aren't so different here than in my hometown. You get up, you fight, you eat if you're lucky. Then you lie down and you get ready to do it all over again. I figured at least with the RDA, the food would be good. It wasn't. No wonder you left. I saw what their soldiers do to people here. People like you. I told Jin, get your stuff, we're leaving. He was happy to leave as well? Jin would be happy anywhere. Give him a stove and some timber to whittle, and he'll die happy. <laughs> now listen, I've been thinking about this. Now that you know what I could do without... We're a real force to be reckoned oh, with. 
It's the job. It's still strange to have you here. <laughs> Wonderfully strange. Like you're back from the grave. It takes them getting used to. For us as well. You are all so strong. Resilient. Tap prepared you for the worst. Just look how well Taylan has adjusted. That's what I wanted for you. A bright future on Pandora. Maybe you should have let us go, like Nor said. Yes, uh... I think about that all the time. At least this way, we're still together. A family? And we can stand as one against Mercer. He came all the way back here for a reason. He wants something. Something big. We'll stop him together this time. 